The shooting happened shortly after 7 o'clock this evening. A man dressed in motorcycle clothing came to the door of Miss Girin's home in Clochran, North County, Dublin. According to Garda sources, the man pointed a gun at Miss Girin's head, then lowered his aim and shot her in the leg. It's not her first brush with gun law. Last October, a shot was fired into the living room of the house she shares with her husband and daughter. It was presumed to be a warning from a crime gang not to push her investigations too far. Shortly after tonight's shooting, she was taken to Beaumont Hospital, where she's being treated for a leg wound. Veronica Guerin is one of Ireland's leading investigative journalists. Over recent months, she's conducted extensive investigations into organised crime in Dublin and has interviewed several leaders of Dublin's criminal underworld. Her latest investigations for the Sunday Independent have been into the man Gardaí suspect of masterminding last week's £3 million robbery at the Brinks Allied Cash Depository in North Dublin. Just last week she was interviewed on RTE's News at One and described the man. A very, very cold individual. Um, uh, not at all warm, not endearing in any way. Um, one could, if we take uh, the late Martin Cahill, one could laugh and joke with Martin Cahill and he was a brilliant conversationalist. He loved talking, he loved listening to stories and he loved telling stories. This guy is completely different, a man of very few words and he's just a very cold looking individual. The man who carried out the shooting is described as stocky in build, about five foot four inches tall.